Tonight, Cranston City officials discussing the proposal of a controversial golf and entertainment facility. Some residents have spoken out against the project, saying it could cause traffic backups. Iowa News News reporter Sheena Lushuto is at tonight's meeting and joins us now live from Cranston with the new details. Sheena? Well, it's been a very long night for the Cranston Planning Commission. It is now hour four of the meeting, and we are just now talking about golf inside behind me. Now, there are lots of people inside waiting for the conversation, and we did catch up with both sides for you. Well, you've probably seen videos like this one all over social media. Top Golf has more than 50 locations around the world, and they're hoping to bring a facility here, replacing the old Citizens Bank building in Cranston. Top Golf knows what they're doing. They're not experimenting. They've got a great facility. Eyewitness News spoke with the developer, Kelly Coates, president of the Carpionato Group. We're ready to commit to the state of Rhode Island for an excess of 20 years. There's just one thing the city needs to approve first, the height of the nets to catch the golf balls. Proposed plans have the nets being around 170 feet tall. The current maximum building height is 100 feet. Due to the height of the nets, the protective nets that keep the balls from leaving the facility, we require approval from both the planning board, which is called an amended master plan, and from the uh, city council. The city planning commission is hearing the master plan at Tuesday's meeting, and residents are also taking the chance to speak up. We hope that the city will stop and think about uh, the negative ramifications for those who live in the neighborhood and nearby. Pauline DeRosa is a founder of the Garden City Alliance. She says the top golf facility would bring major noise and traffic issues. This venue is just not appropriate. We're not against development, but this is not appropriate for our area. Coates says this area here is the only place top golf is considering in Rhode Island. Now remember, the Planning Commission could vote on this tonight, but ultimately it does need to be approved by the full City Council before it can move forward. Reporting live in Cranston, I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.